No. So we were just talking to Larry Michael, who, of course, is the voice of Larry. Larry, you coming over here? I thought you were doing the segment with us. You didn't invite him. Yeah, I we thought you were sitting down with can us. Can you bring Larry a chair? Can Larry, can Larry, here, just take Tim's chair. Here. Yeah, take that. He needs a microphone. He can use this, right? Yep. Larry does a show Larry. every day. Even if it's Still doing May, that? he does it every day. He'll just read emails sometimes, Larry. You crank out <laughs> those shows. What are you all doing? What's it like? Okay, now things are heating up. But you do that daily Redskins Nation show. Get all in the how many, all how, many, year, how many years do you think? You know what? The I'm money say, must be good. I'm gonna how say many you, years? I'm going to say you've been <laughs> doing it for eight years. No, more. Uh, Ten. Fifteen. More. Twenty. No. Play by play, sixteen. That show's okay. been on for eleven and a half years. Wow! Oh my God. But Every I'm, day. like, how challenging is it no, in right. May? May is easy. The players are there. The dry spots are the middle of February <laughs> and the middle of July before camp. Right. And you're replaying some stuff here and there. Right. right. But otherwise, this is right now. It's downhill, baby. Right. You get two <laughs> interviews a day. You got the press conferences. It's a pretty good formula. Uh -huh. What's the big story for you? Like, what are you keeping an eye on? Junkies being here today is <laughs> it's massive. It's, that's the big thing. You can massive. see all the people here early, big right. line outside. Right. You see the line for y'all? <laughs> yeah, that's a big story here for me. Well, yeah, we were. Did you see? Did you see uh, how they welcomed us? No, what they they, they locked us out. They opened <laughs> the door. Huh? We had to, no, they didn't no, open the door. We had to climb the fence, we climb a fence and we had to. Uh, you climb that fence over there? Uh, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. We cut the zip smaller tie one. Yeah, Even yeah. Bish did the that. Smaller Bish one. We did. Yeah, barely. I got over it. You guys really got a just that's the red car situation here. What the heck's going on with the We don't have credentials. I think as soon as we get off the air, they're going to kick us out. No. Your boss just doesn't hook us up. Oh, well, you get your credentials. Yeah, man. we need you guys, credentials. Really you guys come down here. Didn't CK handle that? Yeah. Have you been on the yacht yet? Uh, no, not yet. Not yet. But that's the next invite. I've seen some pictures of you out and about with the the, the privileged crew. <laughs> the well, inside. I'm very, I'm very privileged to work for this organization. I started this job, and you know, we right. go back b w way before 20 anything. Years. The, yeah. new, 20 years. the new sports weekend. Who was your host when we originally started on the um, – your co-host when we started on the weekends Charles in 96? Mann. Charles Mann. Charles you Mann. You did like 11 Charles to 2. Mann. Was that yep, your time yep. slot? And we had the bit one year where we were picking games, and we made a bet. And this is back in the, you know, the days of uh, – you know, we were – You, you guys could be a little more risque. Yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, you know, the, the, uh, the bet was that if I lost, I'd have to wear a Pee Wee Herman outfit and drive him around. Uh -huh. And if, he, if I won, he'd have to clean my gutters. And with six weeks to go, I closed him out. Mathematically, I closed him out. I'm guessing he never cleaned your gutters. He showed up. He oh, showed he up with Channel 9 camera guy. Okay. It might have been Satch. And uh, he got up and took a couple leaves out of the gutter. Okay. Uh, but, he did, but he did show up. <laughs> he did show up. Hey, Those were the days. Camera. It was Those were camera. the days. Those were the days. It was video proof. That's awesome. What are you, what are you excited about, honestly, for this year? What, excited, what's exciting I'm, I'm to I'm you? Excited about, I'm really excited about the defense, obviously. Um, you know, I, I think that defensive line is one of the best in the league. Um but last year they got worn down because the offense, right. Right, you know, it's the like same thing. Everybody knows what happened last year. Really excited about the wide receiving core. I think that has been a – that was a question mark coming here as to would the they have a, good, a lot of good young players. Cam Sims has looked remarkable out here. And, again, you know, he got hurt last year. He's like year. an afterthought. Uh, not anymore. Not really? anymore. Yeah. Right. Helping, you know, right? it, there's a lot so of talent. So he's a definitive top five guy. I think he's. I think he is. Of course, you got Doxson and Richardson, but the younger guys to me are the ones that have caught my eye. McLaren, so Quinn, Sims, everyone's McLaren, talking about right? Quinn. Quinn, Quinn. You know, and they had a the period they had uh, last practice two days ago. They had a red zone at the right. end, right? And the offense, I would think, scored about uh, thirteen to fifteen attempts. Wow. And Josh Norman was coming on the show afterwards. He came on, and you can see that today on Redskins Nation at five thirty. Nice, uh, Josh. That tape is going to run. He was pissed. He he was not happy that they didn't stop him. So, and that was all three quarterbacks. It was to me. It's been impressive to see Colt McCoy play uh, here at camp. I think he came in here with a little bit of a question mark coming off an injury. He's, he's looked kind great. of been the forgotten guy, right? I think he's worked himself. Uh, I think I think he's caught a lot of people's eyes here. He's looked really, really good. And Haskins has looked good. And Case Keenum's looked good. Uh, you got the running back situation. And, he, of course, you have the one thing there that's sitting there that stares you in the face when you're thinking about this football team. And we got a game coming up. Uh, next Thursday in Cleveland, mm -hmm. and 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 the left tackle will not be there. Right. right. And the question becomes, you know, I was saying, well, is he is he going to be there for mini camp? Wasn't there for mini camp. Is he going to be here for training camp? He's not here at training camp. What's next? By the way, he gave What's up next on our agenda. He, he gave one two hundred thousand dollars, I think, by skipping two fifty. Two fifty. I think so. You yeah, guys gave that. that up in appearance money coming down here. <laughs> I could have. We got an appearance tonight. Are really? you join us? Atlas forty two, the fan and friends. We do. We got an appearance. We'll we'll get get on the VIP list. You're getting paid.
Uh, we're actually not, but I it's think okay. it's a contractual <laughs> thing. But believe me, it, it's a whole thing. Me. Wow, we're that's we're gonna have a good time. What did that get set up? Just you, you guys are great planners. We're you on just, in Richmond. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Yep, it's a great sports town here. It's a great town. I, we, I like coming down here. It's easy to get to. You know, ninety-five sometimes can really. Oh, Fredericksburg is a nightmare. It can be. I mean, I got home. Do you uh, stay? Do you stay for the oh, whole yeah. time? I haven't left since I got here. Yeah. We had it. We had a city golf tournament, charity golf tournament, uh, a week ago Tuesday. Oh, uh, a week ago today. Right. And I got here Monday night. It feels like I've been here 10 years, okay? But it's uh, it's close enough to get home, and it's really convenient. The facility is great. Players love it. The hotel's great. Fans are right there. Mm-hmm. I mean, I, I you How, know. How's Jay's a- a attitude been? Like, how's he been? Has he been good? Does he feel the pressure? Like, what's... Of course, you know, you, you're going to be in this position. You feel that pressure, especially when you haven't been to the, the playoffs. And he's, he's said enough things at the podium over the last... Uh, few months uh, you know maybe making references as you guys have heard and i think that's his way of kind of dealing with it uh but here it's all business and things have gone very well for this football team here so so i think you know, everybody feels good there's a little bit of a different vibe i think all these young players they brought in here the last couple of years have really taken over i mean jonathan allen undisputed leader on the team oh my god Th- this guy i i don't i mean if you could just clone him and I think they're trying to with Ioannidis. I think he's close to have been cloned. Mm-hmm. Uh, and, and they're such a tight unit. Tom Sula is kind of the, the mentor. They have really become the heartbeat of the team, which I love because that's something that's going to show up every week. They've got enough depth. Settle is looking good. What about Alex Smith? Larry's What's his role? So, Larry's so positive. Well, he is. He's a positive guy. What's Alex Smith's role? Well, you know what? Between me <laughs> and him, you guys should have some crop neck half air conditioning in here. I don't understand what's going on. We got a little air blowing over there. <laughs> By the way, I can't feel that right now. Is that coming out? You no, should have crop neck half in I'm here. I'm sorry, Mitch. Come on, man. Larry, what, what is Alex? I'm going to hook you up. I don't mean to do What that is anymore. Alex's role? Is he because you know, is he going to mentor? Has he been here every day? What's it? What's it going to be? I've seen him quite a bit here. I I can't tell you he's been here every day but i mean he's such a positive guy he's such right. a good guy and you know he's been through so much and he's still you know he's still got a long way to go but i think everybody looks at him especially the guys that were here last year the rookies obviously don't know him as well and they look at him as a really strong character person who you know he's here it, it when he showed up at practice i want to say it was about two months ago mm-hmm. and he was on the field and he still he, had the fixator he still on. he still had that thing on his leg and he was out there and he was throwing the ball around i got chills watching it because mm. yeah i remember man, that. you know it's just it's just a great another great story is robert davis robert davis the wide receiver right here last year completely tore his knee up uh, i think it might have been three ligaments and everybody's saying well this great prospect that's it for him mm-hmm. he is shining camp ridiculous comeback by this kid it's a good story but back to alex you know, he's here. When I see him, he's here. He's positive attitude. He's going to be involved. He's going to be in the meetings, all I that. I don't know. I don't know what he's going to do, but just having him in the building, having him there and seeing him. and you know, With he, what they went through last year, are they going to keep three quarterbacks? I'm kind of thinking they are. I, I feel mean, like they I have to. They yeah. kind of have to because, you know, you, you got you got injury. If you get an injury and you got a quarterback that has never played. Yeah. But, you know, you don't draft a guy in the first round to have him sit but no, i think no. that's the big question you know how long i don't think he's gonna start right away that's the question i get more from fans is when will haskins start i think the fans the ones here have just shown me uh a lot of knowledge you know they they, they just walk down here you guys walk down here talk to the fans. you know once haskins got to set a couple games and what yeah. you know they've always they are they're all over it so we don't but have if haskins to me if he plays like reportedly he did on sunday let's say he plays close to the level of case I think you got to go with the guy if he's close. If you see things where he's not reading defenses, he's not understanding some certain things. He's holding the ball too long. Then oh, obviously yeah, yeah. you go with Casey. But if it's close to me, he has the edge. I, I, I don't I, think I, there's a problem letting him sit, though. I, I agree. But I agree with both of you. I mean, here's the thing. Uh, you know, he's only going to get past Keenum if Keenum doesn't get it done when Correct. he's in these preseason games. Correct. So the preseason games this year, I think, have some new meaning, more so than usual. Usually, you know, so these preseason games – I think a lot of people are going to be watching the quarterbacks in these games. And, and who comes in? Who starts? Who goes with the twos and the threes? And how do they look? I don't know how you figure that out. Uh, Haskins is going to play, but he's not. is he going to play with the ones? He's probably not know. going to start with the ones in, in game one. Probably but maybe not. they rotate it because, maybe. right, Jay's yep. allegedly rotating these guys and they're getting about they, the same they amount have of snaps. They so wouldn't maybe have you, that much. But maybe you yeah, start see, the problem is case in game number one You're going to have preseason. backup tackles protecting all the right-handed quarterbacks on their blind side. I mean, obviously, that's the, that's that's, a, that's, a situ- that's a situation that everybody's got their eye on, and we'll see. I mean, I, we, something's going to give there one way or the other, you would think, by the time we leave Richmond, or maybe not. Maybe by the time... 
you know, uh, August 31st rolls around at 4 o'clock, and, and uh -huh. the teams have to pare down, and that's somebody out there that comes up. But, uh, you know, Haskins, the one thing I've noticed about Haskins is he is very, he is very quietly confident. He doesn't do a lot oh, of hollering. Yeah. He's a very, he's a student. Really like it about him. And, and obviously he's got every throw. I've been impressed with his short throws. Hmm. He's got a lot of touch. And for a guy who's got a cannon like him, uh, yeah, it's sometimes hard to come by. And Case Keenum's got that swag. I mean, I, he's got the, he's got the, I'm a grizzled veteran, a little bit of a, I don't want to say he's got a little bit of a gut, but he doesn't have a six pack. And, you know, he's he's a man's man kind of guy, and I think everybody's kind of gravitated to him, too. And Case is a good golfer, too. Real good. Did you see him in Tahoe? Oh, yeah. I told him, though, I was watching that. He and shot the 73. The last, the last uh, probably 15 on the final round, he sunk a birdie, but that Stapleford system is the absolute worst thing. He, it's just it's crazy, yeah. garbage. But he gave the weakest left-handed fist pump. <laughs> right. And I said, you got to do that. I said, you're on network TV, and you got a little weak. He goes, yeah, I know. i got to get that right-hand <laughs> fist pump. And it was just weak. Uh-huh. So, but, but, you know, it's, this is camp. Hey, it's practice. All right, let's pick the product yeah. one more time. Redskins Nation, 530, and who's on today? Uh, Josh Norman's on today. Nice. We've got all kinds of stuff. Players wired up, coaches wired up. Uh, we got our 365 series, which we kicked off this year. It's kind of an all-access. I don't want to say hard knocks because we're not in meetings. But it's amazing what if you put a lot of time and get some good equipment and get some good cameras that do super slow motion on how good that video can turn out. So, uh, yeah, 5.30, 11 o'clock as well. There's a replay at 11. I think I'm up to about 5,000 shows. If you multiply nice. the, the number of days, not even the replays. I mean, I, you know, yeah. Charlie was keeping. Well, Charlie's still the producer, day. you know. Yeah, yeah. Say Charlie's hi to Charlie. Charlie. Really. Yeah, yeah. You'll see, see him. He's, see he's, Hill. he's, he's I, here. I haven't he's seen here. him in forever. He's, he's still angry. He still looks sad. <laughs> he's, still, <laughs> he's, still, he's still angry. He's still angry. <laughs> <laughs> that hasn't changed. Love him. Love him. That's why we get along so well. Thank you, Larry. Appreciate it, Pat. Good seeing you guys. Good seeing you guys. Of course, we're broadcasting live from Redskins Training Camp. Keep it here.